said I'm going crazy Well I'm not so sure But there's a pain in our blood And tequila in our hair And I know it's crazy But I'm insecure And I'm not sure why we're going Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to Aklet Tech Today we're looking at the top 5 life hacks for the Google Chromecast yeah, I'm not sure why we're going Number 5. Adding news headlines to your backdrop So right out of the box, the Google Chromecast comes configured to show some beautiful images and artwork as your backdrop, but one thing you can do is also configure it to show the latest news headlines. To do this, simply launch the Google Home app, select your Chromecast in devices, go into backdrop settings, and then select the switch that says curated news. This will turn on curated news and show you some interesting headlines. Switching this feature on doesn't take anything away from the beautiful images and artwork that you typically see on your Chromecast backdrop. Number 4. Using Localcast to route audio to headphones connected to your device. Localcast is a great app that you can get from the Play Store and is definitely an essential if you're on the Chromecast. One of its best features is being able to cast to a television while simultaneously routing audio back to the device you're casting from and therefore being able to plug headphones in and not disturb those around. Number 3. Casting your Google Chrome tab to your TV. This is a pretty simple one that not a lot of people know about. If you download the Chromecast extension for Google Chrome, you can cast your tab directly to any Google Chromecast on the same Wi-Fi network. This is extremely useful for websites and applications that don't yet support the Google Chromecast, or if you're streaming something on your laptop that doesn't have an application you can use to cast to your TV. While there does turn to be some audio lag from time to time, it is the best solution when all else fails. Number two. Turning on your TV with your phone. For this one, you're gonna have to use a provided adapter to plug your Chromecast directly into your wall outlet instead of your TV's USB port. HDMI CEC is a feature found on most modern televisions that allows connected devices to communicate back and forth with your TV. Even though each manufacturer calls this something different, such as E-Link, Simplink, or Arcos Link for my TV, it's usually found and can be enabled in setting. To take advantage of this feature, whilst your TV is off, simply launch any Chromecast supported application, select the cast icon, then select your Chromecast device. Once selected, your TV will switch on and begin playing what you've casted to it. It automatically switches to the correct input your Chromecast is connected to. This is really convenient and saves you from having to look for that television remote you can never seem to find. Number 1. Controlling your Chromecast with your TV remote. This is another one that makes use of HDMI CEC. With HDMI CEC enabled, some of the buttons on your TV remote controls such as play and pause can be used to control your Google Chromecast. This is a great feature for those times you just can't seem to find your cell phone or when someone else is casting to your Google Chromecast. Joining the preview program to get the latest updates for your Chromecast. Even though you might not see life changing updates as soon as you join the preview program, this is one way to get early updates to your Google Chromecast. To do this, simply launch the home app, go into settings, then select the preview program to switch it on. Being one of the first to try a cool new feature can never be a bad thing. Thanks for watching. Please smash that like button, it goes a long, long way. And be sure to subscribe and stay tuned for the next one.